What's up, everybody? This is Peter again for Sports Hot Rumors and Debates. How are you guys today? Before the NFL starts today, man, I want to just talk about one thing that I've seen really fast from Keyshawn Johnson, the ex-analyst. He said that the Arizona Cardinals are a 6-7 to seven win team, and he made a bet with, I forgot who it was, for like $200 for like a charity. Now, here's a couple of things. Keyshawn Johnson is right about a lot of things that he said about the Arizona Cardinals. They're lacking in a lot of areas, and you guys know I'm a diehard Cardinal fan. I agree with him completely. There's a lot of things that we can get better at. Christian Kirk is hurt. He's out again. Big shocker with that one, right? I expect Keyshawn Johnson to step up today. Somebody's going to step up, especially Isabella. That's a couple of things, right? But Kenyon Drake will be the key to the Arizona Cardinals today. Kenyon Drake will probably score, if I'm correct, two to three touchdowns. I expect him to run for about probably 130, and I expect him to catch for a touchdown. That is my prediction. I think Kenyon Drake's going to run all over them. That's one, two. Let's go back to Keyshawn Johnson. Keyshawn Johnson is ridiculous. I don't know if he's smoking weed or whatever he's doing, but that guy clearly, clearly is bugging if he thinks that they're going to be a 6-7 to seven win team. And let me explain why. They will be 5-0, and oh, right? They will be 5-0. and oh. So they, he's expecting them to only win one or two games after that. I, I, I'm sorry, man. I, I understand, you know, you know, weed is a very powerful drug, but I don't know what the hell he's smoking. So the Arizona Cardinals are a 10 to an 11 win team. That's the truth. However, what he does say on the other side is right. There are some things that they're lacking and you can't expect every Kyler Murray to do all these things. And when there's some great teams that can play you better and then our defense cannot hold up all the time against really good teams. So I agree with him there. I 100% has been so hard on the Cardinals saying this. I've been saying that we need somebody else. Kirk is out. So this is agreed. But if you're thinking this is a 6-7 to seven win team, then I completely Everything you just said is completely not valid. That's just the truth. Let's talk about another team who's going to win, the Chicago Bears. The Chicago Bears are going to be a team now to be reckoned with. And I'm going to tell you why. Because if Trubisky can figure this out, if Mitchell Trubisky can figure out how to go around and do some things, then with their defense who can play really well, and then Montgomery playing better, and that'll open up for Montgomery if Trubisky plays better. Allen Robinson, to me, is a good ball player. So the Bears can... They're definitely going to win today. They're going to beat the Falcons. Falcons don't understand what defense is. Trubisky is going to do extremely well in fantasy quarterbacks, and so is Montgomery. So definitely play those guys. But, you know, thinking about these teams who could go 3-0, and those are the two teams that come to mind that's a lot to me to go 3-0 and is Arizona. Now, look, Detroit got Galladay back. I get that. I understand that Detroit has one of these things where, you know, their record is not as bad as how they play, and it's true because they're in almost all games. Swift catches that ball the first game. It's a big, di big different story, right? That the Lions are always in it, but after a while that starts weighing on the team. And now that um, Trufan is out too, so either Hopkins is going to run all over the rookie, or Arizona is just going to Hopkins can take other people out, and then uh, Kyler and Drake are going to run up the middle for fun. Because if you looked at what Aaron Jones did to them last time, I expect Drake to do pretty much the same. Okay, so expect that. And um, if you look at my videos from way back. I mentioned the two teams that are to be reckoned with are the Buffalo Bills and the Arizona Cardinals. Those are the two surprise teams that I said. And so far, I, my, my predictions have been spot on. Arizona will be 3-0 today on our way to 5-0. Talk to you soon. Bye.